YouTube totally wanks is here. I wanted to talk about this school shooting in the Arapaho High School in Colorado, which apparently is only eight miles from Columbine and right down the street from the Aurora Movie Theater, too. So obviously, this county is having some real freaking issues with guns and people that are absolutely and completely and totally insane. And that's all it is. Apparently, the whole deal was this kid was after a librarian named Mr. Murphy that he didn't like or whatever. Maybe he gave him a bad grade. Nobody knows. It's all speculation at this point. We know that one person was shot in the head and is in critical condition in the hospital. Another one did not suffer any gunshot wounds, but was actually, I don't know, knocked down, something like that, went to the hospital and was released. And they keep putting this here shooter in with the others saying there was one fatality, one fatality. That fatality was just him killing himself because he didn't want to get caught or he couldn't deal with the pressure or whatever the hell. So, guys, this happens one year after Sandy Hook. It happens in a town in Colorado where they have a lot of problems. You know, there's a lot of speculation on this happened, oh, the government did it. Don't listen to the hype, you know, you don't know. Just let it roll. Let's see what happens with it. Let's see what is going to end up coming from it, what kind of information we get. And then uh, apparently the teachers reacted by taking the kids into classrooms, shutting off the lights, and hiding in a corner. That's kind of not what I would be doing if there was a shooter. I'd be running outside. I don't care what the teacher says. I'm not going to get shot because of that teacher, you know. Um, if you stand in a corner, it kind of makes it easy target, you know what I mean? Especially I'm going to hang out in the corner with the lights off. It's just going to make me hide so well. Um, not so much. But I hope you guys are noticing that this gun violence thing is on a rise. And it's not because of law-abiding gun owners. It's because of mental health. So what we need to do is figure out without people starting to get put into being nuts categories and stuff to take their guns away, which is what might happen with this Obamacare crap. So we need to pay attention to that as well. But more that, uh, you know, we need to pay attention to the mental health of people. And why is it so bad? Why are people going crazy what is happening? What has changed in the past 20, 30 years that has caused so many people to go nuts? You know, why aren't we looking at that? What chemicals have we put in the food? What chemicals have we put people on, like antipsychotic medications when they don't need it? What is going on that is causing people to go out and want to kill other people? when they didn't want to before. Tilly Winks is signing off. Oh, and by the way, guys, um, y'all all know I'm pretty good at answering comments. I'm actually really good at it. I do it every day. <clears throat> but for the past couple weeks, Google Plus has not allowed me to comment back to any of your comments. So if you notice that I haven't commented back and you're worried about me because it's something I normally do, it's not me it's the darn google plus not letting me comment back i can get to under the comment i can try to comment back but it will not when i push the comment button it will not let me comment i don't know why i'm gonna have to email them but uh stay with me guys i definitely am reading all your comments paying attention to what you're saying totally winks is signing off rate comment subscribe and i am out of here